Hello, welcome to Tabletop CP. Today we head to the Elbe River, April 25th, 1945, for a game of bolt action. So the 12 days of gaming continue, as in I'm off for 12 straight days, so I plan on getting some serious gaming in. And today, Steve is going to come in to the Nerd Cave with his Soviets. And I will be playing the American, so that is where the Elbe River comes in. It's kind of a what-if scenario, and really just an excuse to get the Americans versus the Soviets. So when the Americans and Soviets met at the Elbe River, uh, the two forces linked up. It was completely peaceful. They had a handshake, and that was it. But in this case, we're going to say some shots were fired and a small little pitched battle ensued. The mission we will use for today's battle will be scenario 12 from the rulebook, Sectors. So in this game, we'll be deploying in table quarters. We'll roll off to see who gets to pick the table quarter, and the other player will deploy in the opposite table quarter. For deployment, you can deploy anywhere in your table quarter. That's at least 12 inches from the center of the board. And you can deploy all of your army, or you can declare how many of your units are going to be left in reserve, and that can be up to half of your army rounding down. Deployment will be alternating deployment. We'll take all of our order dice for the units that we're going to deploy, and put them in a bag, and just draw and deploy as they come out. For victory points, you get one victory point for each unit killed. And each unit that is inside one of the neutral um, table quarters, the ones that we don't deploy in, is going to be worth a point, and if you have a unit fully in the enemy's home sector, that's going to be worth three points. And then if there's, if you have a unit that's kind of straddling, I think you take the whatever uh, sector the most models from that unit is in, you get the points for that. And that's it. So pretty straightforward. Uh, pretty much move into the enemy um, sector and try to secure the neutral sectors, and at the same time try to defend your own sector. And I think that's it. So, oh, there is a preparatory bombardment for both players as well. So now we'll take a quick look at the terrain. All the terrain on this board is soft cover. All the buildings are soft cover. These fences are soft cover. There's a four inch line of sight, so you gotta be within four inches of it to be seen or see through it. We have an orchard here, which is soft cover, which does not block line of sight. We have three pieces of dense terrain, which do block line of sight. So one here, one here, one here. We have some wheat fields. We also have some patches of grass. These are going to be soft cover as well. So that's it for terrain, a lot of soft cover. Some pretty open ground um, as well, mixed in with some decent line of sight blocking terrain. That will do it for terrain and mission. Now we'll take a look at the forces. I will be playing the part of the American forces today. This is 1,195 points. We decided on 1,200 points. I got about as close as I could. Uh, 13 order dice. So start here we have a regular lieutenant with man, submachine guns, veteran bazooka, veteran medic. We have a platoon here, three line squads, all regular, full squads, 12 men, two BARs, sergeant with SMG. I'm also going to bring a six-man pathfinder unit and an eight-man late war paratrooper unit. Both of these are stubborn veterans. Uh, we do have a light machine gun in the paratrooper squad. Everything over here is regular. Medium mortar with spotter. Light howitzer. And it does have the gun shield upgrade. We also have a three quarter ton dodge with pinnel mounted machine gun. Holds eight men. A one and a half ton truck with machine gun. And a um, 105 Sherman. And that is the American force. So okay, go ahead and take a look at the Soviets. Steve is here, he's going to go over his force. So we've got a, uh, everyone's regular except for these two units are veterans. This is the junior lieutenant, two veteran SMG squads, two trucks with pencil mounted uh, machine guns, quad Maxim, uh, BA-6 armored car, heavy mortar, two regular LMG squads, this is three divisional gun, anti-tank rifle, flamethrower team, sniper team, and free squad. So no spotter for the mortar? Oh, there is a spotter. Okay. He's just not out. We'll he's, have to do that. So He's undercover. He's in cover. What we'll do now is um, 
I've, I've gone over the mission with Steve, so we've already picked table quarters. Now we're going to deploy and we'll come back and start turn one. We've completed deployment, so I'll start off over here. So I have an American squad here, regulars. My airborne squad is here on the end. My medic, my officer, another regular squad. Medium order over on the edge over here. I have my light howitzer and my mortar spotter. The Soviets. Uh, Steve has his mortar spotter here. His heavy mortar is back there. LMG squad, AT rifle, BA6, another LMG squad, inexperienced squad, ZIS-3, and sniper. So in reserve, Steve has both his veteran SMG squads, both trucks, the quad maxim. In reserve, I have my uh, 105 Sherman, my bigger truck, with the squad, the beep with the Pathfinder squad and the bazooka. And now we will roll for preliminary barrage. So mine's coming in, yours is coming in. All right, so we'll go ahead and roll up everything, figure out the results and we'll be back. We'll be back. We'll actually do this on camera. So we'll start uh, spotter, nothing. That's two pins. Okay, this is a good one here. Come on, six. Nope. One That's pin. one pin. Two pins. Two pins. Uh, the, is this three? Nothing. Mortar. Two pins. And the sniper. Two pins. So no direct hits, but a lot of pins put out. So we'll go ahead and let Steve do mine. Begin over here with the squad. One pin. One pin. Um, paratrooper squad. Two pins. Water. A uh, hit. A hit, okay. We'll, get, we'll come back to that. The medic. Just one pin. One pin. The officer. The squad. One pin. And the howitzer. Oh no, it's another hit, okay. And then the, finally, the spotter. Please miss. Oh no! I could lose my spotter. So go ahead and roll them up. So it's a plus three pen. So the spotter's regular, so anything but on him, he's dead. Oh, he survived. survived. He does take two pins. And so does the howitzer as well. So the howitzer is going to be a plus uh, plus three, so anything but. So it's one dead. And I believe on a six, since it's a heavy weapon, you could have possibly destroyed the howitzer. But they do take two pins and they take a casualty. And then roll uh, one more for the mortar. So it's another dead. So two pins on the mortar. And then one dead each in the mortar and howitzer, and that's it. So we'll begin the game. Steve will be playing the part of Bagman tonight. And I see a lot of rallying coming up. I just mortared my, or rallied my mortar, <laughs> <laughs> mortared my rally. <laughs> so so we Steve attempted to pass an order with the BA-6. It failed, reversed, and went down. How many pins does he have? The BA6? Yeah. Just one. Okay. Uh, let me think about what I want to do now. The squad passed their order. They advanced into these woods, and we're going to fire on the LMG team over there. So I have two rifles in range and the two BARs. It'll be long range, soft move. cover. Move. No move. Okay. Americans have that rule. No movement penalty. So what is that? Fives? Two hits. Two hits. <clears throat> and needing fours. Nothing but a pin. What do you got? Three pins now? Yep. Sweet. All right, next die. That'll help out. Okay, I'm going to try to pass an order with my airborne squad. Um, two, two pins, so command 10. 
Minus two plus one for my lieutenant. So needing a nine, pass. So we drop to one and we can do something. Airborne squad has made it up to here. We're gonna fire at the guys in the in the brush over there, the same squad. So it's gonna be four shots for the machine gun, needing sevens, because he does suffer a minus one movement penalty. One possible, nothing. Then the four rifles are gonna be needing six. So one hit. Another pin, and then a four plus to kill. So one kill and a pin. So they're up to four pins now. So they're definitely going to be rallying. And next die. That's uh, that's you. Oh, that's me. Yeah, you're the red and the tan. The He's going to have the Zis three fire. Yeah, he can just see this guy here. So I'm needing a five. That's not miss. Five. Jones was sticking out a little far there on the end. <laughs> That's you again. You tried to pass an order with a two pin heavy motor and failed with an eight. Would have been a pass with the rally though. Another Soviet die. Failed an order with his sniper with two pins. So That's two fails in a row. Three. <laughs> Three fails in a row. So we're getting lucky on the American side so far. My light howitzer rallied, lost his pins. Soviet die. All right, I'm learning from, I'm just going to rally everybody. There you go. Point. It's almost when you get to two pins and you're a regular or less, that's almost rally territory immediately is two pins. So rally in the LMG squad. They do. So they lose D6 plus one. So lose three. three. That's all they had, right? They have four. Okay. So they are not pin free. Next die. So another in. Soviet die. Rally some other people. Rallying the other LMG squad. They do pass. So they're pin free, right? They only had two. Yeah. Can't to uh, lose any less than. They could still two. roll a one just to prove that it's possible. They could. Still lose two though. Americans. This squad failed their order with one ten and the officer nearby with an eleven. Another Soviet die. Yeah. Experienced squad rallied all their shots off. I'll use those terms interchangeably throughout the game, I'm sure. Another Soviet die. Steve was out of things to do. Everything's in reserve, so he's done. And the last two things I had to do, I moved my medic up here. And my officer failed his order with one pin. And that's it. So I'll move on to turn two. Top to turn two. Soviets. Steve passed his order with that LMG squad there. So he's pin free. He's going to fire at my regular squad in the forest. With the two machine guns, who are the only thing that have range. He's in it's, yeah, long range software. So, one, two, two hits. Needing fours. Oh no. Two dead and a pin. Roll the six again. You might be able to kill something good. No. Two dead and a pin. Ouch. Two riflemen killed. Alright, next die. American. Tried to pass over the squad in these woods here. They foobarred actually. No enemy within 12 though, so they just fell back as fast as they could, which is six inches since they're in cover. Went down. And another Soviet die. So the squad advanced up to the fence. They're going to shoot through the gap at my airborne. So it's going to be sixes for the rifles, fives for the machine guns. What are you doing first? Those machine guns. Okay. Got two hits. Two hits. And these are veterans. And then we got, uh, Six rifles. And they are needing sixes. Oh man. Two more. So four total hits. Three, five. Yep. One, One dead. dead and a pin. So a dead. Oh, I got my medic there. Hold on. You can do it. Come on. Hell no. We just lost a, a rifle. And we took a pin. Next die. Soviets again. This guy failed his order yet again. He's backed up as far as he can go. He can't go any further. That one pin has stopped him two turns in a row. Another Soviet die. He's going to fire the AT gun part of the Zis at these guys here. Needing a five. It's a hit. So say... It's a one inch template. Do I get two? Yeah, two hits. There's only two guys left. So you just need... Uh, 
threes. One dies. I think it's D2 pins for that as well. So we'll see how many pins we get. One. One pin and a morale test because I'm down to one dude. They're fine. So one guy left on the howitzer. The reason he fired the AT gun is because it wouldn't be long range. Of course, I still think you rolled a six, you would have hit it either way, right? I would have hit it either way. <laughs> and another Soviet die. That's Sniper it. attempted to rally and failed. Rolled a 10. Hard times back here. Man, another Soviet die. What's going on here? What, have I gotten any? I got one. Um, I got one, one dice so far. These guys? You got dice in the bag. I would hope so. Considering I've only moved How many order dice do you have now? I should have 13. It's like even. Eight. Quad Maxim attempted to come in from reserves and failed. I failed orders today. Here we go. I'm going to activate this guy. Passed an order with him. With the one guy left, he's going to do an indirect fire shot onto the Zis 3. Needing a 6. Nope. So miss there, and if I get a dirt, an early dice in the next turn, I might be able to take one more. Otherwise, he's well, I'm not ranged in. I still need a five to hit you. Yeah, but if you get the first die, you could take him down. Americans again. Pass an order with my airborne squad. So they're down to one, and I went on to ambush. These guys advanced up. I was just telling Steve I forgot their full strength. I should have been able to reroll that failed order in the very first turn when they failed with one pin. But like Steve said, we barely, rarely ever see that rule come into play. With another Soviet die. I'm gonna try to hit your guy with my AT rifle. AT rifle, all right, so long range, soft cover. Need a five. Need a five. It's a hit, it's a plus one, so uh, just four, four up. Oh no, a six. Reroll your six. Oh, oh man, oh. spinning. So another pin on the airborne, and another dead rifle. And I can't reroll. I can't use my medic because that's a heavy weapon. So, well, that's my squad leader. Uh, we'll just take this rifleman out. All right, next day. Not going to bring the ambush on that. I'm trying to save that for something else. That's you. You've attempted to bring this squad in with the officer and the veterans and failed. The truck failed the order. I decided to just run my beep come on. So he came in and he ran full speed right to there. We'll see how that works out for me. So another Soviet die. Heavy motor rallied. He's pin free now. Passed his order. Can't say the same for the Soviets. sniper. Soviets again. Oh. He failed. Another order to come in with these guys. So all, all the reserves are refusing to come in. At least Steve's reserves. I still got couple of new reserves to try myself. My officer advanced, passed his order, he advanced up, joining those guys on the road. Next die. You again. So I think the last thing Steve has is his inexperienced like squad. Left? Oh no, these are all the guys. Oh yeah, the truck. guys in the vehicle. So this will be Steve's last dice that he can activate anything with and is the inexperienced squad. The inexperienced squad is kind of snaked out. He's trying to, did you get half of them in the cover? Yeah, yeah they're half. So, <laughs> according to the rules of bolt action, you guys are in soft cover. <laughs> but he's gonna fire at the back end of the beep, needing sixes. That one, no, no and a six again. No, but it is a pin on everything, inside. And then the rest are mine, so I got just my tank and my squad and the truck left. 105 Sherman's come in over here. We're gonna fire the main gun at these guys along the fence. So just moved, not long range, no cover. And the bow gun over here. So main gun here. Ah, this is why I hate tanks in bolt action. There's just too much of a chance of them doing nothing. So needing sixes over there. So I got one hit on the heavy mortar and he's a four up. Nothing but a pin. Man, so I've wasted a turn bringing him in reserves, and now I've missed, so that's two out of the six turns the tank has done nothing. Luckily, these howitzer tanks are actually cheaper than regular tanks, even though they're better units in the game. 
it was under 200 points for that. So the rest were mine, so I have my mortar and my other squad. So I'm going to fire my mortar at your uh, those guys over there in the grass. Leading the six. Nope. So I'll start ranging in on them. And my final reserves are going to be the regular squad in this truck. They're coming in somewhere. Where do I want to bring them? The truck is entered over here next to the Sherman. Actually, not a very good spot to put them in, and now I'm blocking. <laughs> I can't shoot the damn Sherman. Hmm. Okay, anyway, so he's going to fire his pencil at the mortar. So sixes again. Nothing. But I do have a unit in here, and that should be the last thing. So let me get them out. The squad got out, and I've completely blocked my Sherman now, so that was not well thought out. Uh, but they are out. They're all in range, even the SMG of the mortar. So they're going to fire. It's long range, right? Long range. Yep, long range, soft cover, no movement. So just fives. One, two, three hits. That is pretty bad. Unless I can do some damage here. One dead. Three hits and one dead out of all that shooting. That is pretty rough. And uh, yeah, at least you got the That's it, right? Yeah. So end of turn two. Before we begin turn three, I actually pulled these guys. I passed their order, or I passed the roll, so they're gonna actually fire on these guys. But they got two pins on them, so it's gonna oh, wait, be. You to pass the order too, right? No, uh, you don't have to pass an order to do an ambush. Oh, it's because you passed the order to put them on the ambush. Yeah. Okay. And but I'm gonna need long range, soft cover, and two. Yeah, sevens. One possible. No. All right, now we begin turn three. Turn three. Now, now it becomes important who gets that first die. Come on, green. No. AT rifle. AT rifle. I'm just kidding. He resists his turn, and he's going to fire point blank at the beep. So a three to hit. Actually, wouldn't you need a four, or is it soft cover? Or, yeah, you're close enough to the edge. You're not in cover at all. No, but I mean you're shooting through the forest. But... Uh, if you're in here, you you don't you don't take cover when you're in cover. But you moved. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> so anything but really, because I think you're yeah anything but full pin. Oh, you're right. I did move though, so that's minus one. Right? Yeah. So but you're point blank. Oh, so it's three. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Does not penetrate. No. Next, next die. So Another good. Soviet dice. The experienced squad has moved around. These three guys are going to need fours. I'm really worried about that beep. Nope. And then uh, fives for the last two guys. Oh, there it is. The that was all I cared about. There's the pin. So three there's pins. the three, three pins. Three pins now. for the price of one. Man, I needed that first die. Or the second die. Or the third die would be nice. <laughs> there we there go. You. So I got my three pins. Three pin ambush. <laughs> Squad advanced. I need to start making some room for my Sherman. They're going to advance up and we're just going to fire. See if we can take out that mortar. So this time it's going to be fours. One, two, three, four, five. Five hits. Man. It's not even half. I, so five hits, but this time I'm needing fours. I guess I needed fours last time. So yeah, they're dead. So mortar wiped out. So that's one uh, point for me. Let me take out one dice. Then we move on to the next next die. That's you. Quad Maxim failed another order, so we're on turn three already. So by the time he gets in, we're only going to have a couple of turns left. The truck has backed up, and we're going to fire the machine gun at the inexperienced squad, sort of the soft cover. So just, what's Plus the range there? Soft cover moved. There in range. So just regular range. So just move soft cover. So fives. 
a hit. That's a pin on them. And a three plus. Oh, I killed one. Cool. Take the guy out of the cover and then we'll <laughs> to take one guy out of the tree and suddenly they're not in well, soft cover. Anymore. See if they become veterans. Are they green? They're green. Oh, okay. So on a five plus, right? With one die or two? I think it's one. <laughs> oh, so they go regular. They become regulars. I didn't know that the free guys could get that rule. All right, next die. I said the Germans have one that they actually roll again. And then if you got a, another one, you would become a veteran, which is pretty good. My Sherman is going to fire at them, but Steve's going down, so needing a five. Come on, five. No. Next die. I thought some, it just cut the damage in half. I didn't realize it made it harder. Yeah, minus two to hit, as well as cuts the damage in half. That would have been a hit if he didn't go down. Another one of mine. Okay. Getting a string of them here. My mortar is going to fire at the guys in the grass over there. So they failed the first time, so they're down to a five. Nope. Next die. That's Soviet. Steve Sniper has passed his order and he's taken off and just got out of there. Not a safe place for a sniper, apparently. Next die. That's you so again. again. Try passing over for the third time with the armored car. Can you fail again? Oh, he passes. Eight. One pin. Ah, uh, yeah, you passed. I was gonna say if you were, if you had the two, you would have failed again. The armored car is gonna actually get to activate. The armored car is driven up here. He's gonna fire. He's got two LMGs on it, so it'll be eight shots and firing at these guys. So it'll be so a long range. Soft oh, cover. Or? Shooting yeah, through the wheat field. I would say so. Yeah. So long range move. So sixes. Nothing. Nothing. Would have been a hit without the cover. And okay, so the at least the BA six is now on the move. The greatest BA six in the history of the world because he's what started fighting and against the Japanese over on the east <laughs> in the in the thirties. <laughs> he's moved. To the you know westward to the eastern front, and here he is in uh, late April 1945, still going. So quite the armored car. These guys failed their order, even with the officer there. So they're down. And another Soviet guy. The squad that was in the grass is going to move out from underneath the ranging in mortar brush. They're going to fire on the airborne. They're down. Soft cover. So that's three. So you're going to have sevens. For sure. No, the LMGs are regular range, right? Yeah, but it's still down and the soft cover is minus three right there. Plus the move. So Okay, so I'll put them all in. Yeah. I was thinking sixes. The only good thing of going down. Unintentionally. If they weren't down, that would be a hell of a hell of a roll. So nothing. Okay. Dodged a bullet there. Next die. Soviets. Soviets. So you're pretty much down to reserves, right? Everything on the. Oh, you got your AT rifle over there. He hasn't activated. Um, so the two trucks. Yeah, it's bringing it. All right, here we go. Don't fail. He's already failed five orders over here. All right, they're coming in. One of the one of the uh, truck units is coming in. The truck drove on. He's going to fire at these guys. So just moved, I guess, in the open because you're higher up off the ground, I guess. Or? Well, you're not in the cover. I'm shooting out of the cover. Okay. This one was shooting through it, so I can kind of... Oh, you're in it. I see what you're saying. Okay. You were shooting across it before I got So, one hit. Because you're not long range, right? Nope. You just moved. Oh, so a four plus. Shock. Okay. But now there's a bunch of veterans uh, with SMGs about to... Is that the one with the flamethrower in it? Yeah. Okay. Oh boy. Hello, Sherman. We need you. <laughs> Soviets again. So they can get out now. So these guys got out with the all their uh, um, submachine guns, and they're going to fire 
at the squad here. So just needing fours on 16 shots. Do you have a 16 there? Getting close. Yeah, I got it. As I said, I think there's 16 complete green dice, but I don't know if they're all in there. Just needing fours. It's a lot of fours. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten out of sixteen. So just four is to wound. This could be bad. This could be very painful. One, five, and then roll the six again. So five dead. Man. Well, you know what? I need to make room for the Sherman. So, damn. But all my good stuff's over here. My uh, leader. One, two, three, four, five. But that's not a morale test because I had 12 dudes in there. So, next die. Oh, this guy can't get out. So, what am I doing? Well, he can on the next time he pulls the dice. He's got the flamethrower still in the truck. Americans. Zis 3 about to, or no, I'm sorry. My lighthouse is going to fire at the Zis 3, needing a 5 this time. Boom. Got it. So it's a 2 inch template, so I could probably get those three guys there. It's plus 2, so anything but. There's a 4 man crew. So 3 dead. Yes. D3 pins, 1 pin. And a morale test at minus one. Minus one. Yep. So I need an uh, eight. Very good. That's okay, so slow. they're down to one, dude. So it'll be minus one to hit. And you're ranged in. So. And I'm ranged in. So next die. Soviets. AT rifle ran up to the fence. Soviets again, so you got to be getting down to your last reserves at this point. I don't see anything left on the board. Yeah, so you got four dice, no, three dice left after that. I don't know. Yeah, I think everything on the board is gone. Oh, you got your uh, flamethrower inside the truck. You could get out. Truck has come in over here. I'm going to shoot at these guys with a machine gun. Season fours, I believe. Pin. These guys failed this order with one pin last time. Wow. Nothing but a pin. Alright, I need the next die. I can't take a salvo of SMG fire here. But I gotta see if I can pass an order. So here we go. This is an important order. I guess if I fail, though, at least it'll still be minus two to hit, right? Oh man, one more and I would have had insane heroism. So let's see what these guys are going to do. You guys passed the order. They advanced up here to get behind this line sight blocking terrain. And we're going to fire at that squad there. So just long range, no movement penalty, plus the one pin. So fives. And we got one, two, three hits. We got a pin on those guys. Three possible. Two dead. Not too shabby. A bunch of a bunch of regular Joes. Next die. Me again. Eh, what do I have left here? Do I, oh, I got all these, all the guys in the beep. <laughs> I'm going to try to, but they've already activated. True. Um, so I got three pins on everything in here. I do have veterans though. My um, Pathfinders are veterans, so... I don't, I'm gonna ha I'm gonna probably rally the beep and the uh, bazooka. Actually, the bazooka is a veteran too. Hmm. Well, let me just see if I. I usually would never do a three-pin order like this. So oh. who's the order? Who's uh, the uh, pathfinders. Okay. So I need seven. Oh. And it's insane heroism. So it's like. Okay. Let me figure this out. I think I removed you D6 remove all your more. Pins and everyone within 12 inches takes a hit. So. Is it D6 more or D3 more? <laughs> well, either way, that's all of them. 
That's a, that's a game changer. Isn't so it? the badass Pathfinders jump out, and we're gonna hose something down. These guys got out. They are going to fire, or should I just try to t finish off the Zis? No, it's yeah. already pretty bad off. Yeah, you should probably shoot the Zis. I'm gonna shoot these guys. So they're regular now. Uh, point blank, he's in soft cover, so back to threes. 12 shots, they each have an SMG. So quite a few twos. But I got two, four, Seven. six, eight. Yep, eight hits. And they are regulars now because of that green roll. No! Oh, oh geez, man. That's a mess. Holy crap. That would have been all if they were still uh you're still, but that's a shitload of hits here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven dead. And let's see if it's anyone important. No. This squad right here is badass. Pathfinders. Yeah, they just shrugged up. Insane three heroism like hopped out. Cigar in mouth, blasted the hell out of those Soviets. So take a morale check at minus two. Oh, good. Yeah. Wow. Now they're upgraded. Those veterans. guys are pretty good. Yeah, now they're veterans. Yeah, next die. That was quite the uh, maneuver. Whoa. <laughs> okay. It's a green dice. That's mine, huh? There's a lot of green dice. Uh, and then I think, yeah, all I have left are the... Well, I had such good luck. Should I just try to pass an order with the beep? Actually, that's not a bad idea, because he'll just back up out of there. Now, let me see if I can get the uh, bazooka out of there first. Yeah, he makes it. So he's going to come out. He's going to have two pins, though. Can you grab my bazooka for me, please? And now that we've got some more space here, we'll... Uh, Come out over here. Actually, I got your armored car lined up. Zuka got out. And he's gonna see if he can take out the Zis 3. I was gonna come out here and try to take a shot at the armored car, but it would need the sevens with the long range moved and all the pins. But only here I need a five, so I'm, I think. I need a three, I'm point blank, but plus three more for the moved. Yeah, five. It's a hit. So you got a gun shield there. Uh, actually, it's still anything but it because it's like plus five. <laughs> the bazooka takes out the Zis 3. Nice. Okay, and next, next die. Suddenly the side is looking a lot thinner. Me again. So that's the beep. So I guess I will try to pass an order with the beep. Seven. No, he failed. So he's going to go back. Beep is pulled back. Went down because he failed his order. So actually that didn't work out. Well, it worked out a hell of a lot better than I thought it was going to. Next die. Soviets. Guys in that truck over there went down. You got two. You got your uh, officer and your SMG squad in there, right? Yes. What do I even have left here? Oh, I still got this full squad and my oh my medic, all that stuff. They're gonna stay put here, and we're just gonna fire onto the AT rifle. So it'll be fives for the BARs and fours for everyone else. So one hit with the BARs. No, I'm sixes with everyone else, not fours. Everyone else, the rifles are all sixes. So two more. You remember what I said? Two. Yeah, two is what you're saying. I got uh, or three. Hits. Three. Yeah. yeah, I think it's three. So three hits, so point of sh shock, and then they're regulars? Yes. They're toast. Another kill point. That's three enemy units killed. And next die. Soviets, so you got your officer still in your truck. You still got your flamethrower in your truck as well. And I think that's the last two you have. He put his officer down. Next one is another Soviet die. So it's the last one, I think. It's and it's his flamethrower. Flamethrower got out of the truck over to here. And the last two dice I had were my officer. My medic there is going to hang tight there. And Soviet or the Americans get the first die. The Soviets are down three. So I think he started out with... 13. Yeah. So we both started out with 13. So he's at 10. I'm at 
still at 13. Pathfinders have advanced. We're going to fire on those guys. They went down. So now I need sixes. Not a single freaking hit. 12 dice, not a six. <laughs> what are the odds of that? Uh, low. Very low. All right, next die then. Die? Flamethrower's coming up. He's going to try to take out my Pathfinders. I was hoping he wouldn't have the range to make it into there, but I guess since you can't pre-measure in this game. Which, it's just one die, though? I don't get one die for each guy? No. Yeah, he misses anyway. Kind of used to like that. Like a good flamethrower does. Next die. These guys are touched man, by magic. They're uh, invincible, I think. Another Soviet die. Teflon. He's going to fire at the magical unit here. He kind of moved his armor car around this way and needing just fours for moved. Wow, two hits. I told you, man, these guys are uh, they're veterans. No! Not veteran enough. Oh, man. And you can roll, well, I guess to see if you kill the leader, they're all the same. Okay, so the leader and one other guy dies. And we take up 10. Damn, that was brutal. My leader, and then just one other guy will die here. All right, next die. Americans. My pinnel mount on my truck will fire at his veteran SMG squad. Need fives. There we go. Three hits. Come on, give me one. Give me one. Two and a six. So just two die and a pin. It's pretty sweet for a pinnel mounted 15 point machine gun. Next die. I was going to assault with my bazooka. His flamethrower, but I forgot I had the two pins. Um, all right, let me think about it. Sherman moved up and he's going to fire. They went down. So everything's sevens. So the white's going to be the main gun, the other's the bow machine gun. Nothing. Next die. Americans again. Uh, what the hell can I even do here? Um, these guys here. I'll try to or should I just rally them. Let me think about what I want to do. So I did pass my order with my bazooka. I'm charging his flamethrower. So each, I simultaneous, I suppose, since we're in some cover here. So fives. Got one of yours. You got one of mine. So let's see. Not anyone important. I don't know if that even works for this game or for assault. <laughs> so we each lost a guy. Uh, so it's a draw. Yeah, what happens then? I don't know if we've ever had a draw. <laughs> Do we just keep fighting? I guess so. All right, one each. <laughs> no. No. All right. Uh, keep going. I get. I really don't know what we're doing here. No. Let's <laughs> make up the rules. <laughs> yeah, I... I <laughs> exercise First and roll of mine. <laughs> We just can't roll. <laughs> There you go, he's dead. Oh no! Bazooka won. Uh, Hell yeah. So I'm down to a dude with a bazooka. Next is Soviet. So next die, please. So he's down four. I hope we did that right. I'm not sure. Maybe there's. I'm thinking of Erewhon where if you fight twice, you actually break apart. I don't know if that's in this game because we don't. The, the assaults are usually so decisive in this that. You don't have a bunch of ties. I'm gonna advance. So he advanced his truck up. I went down. He shot and got one hit. And a pin. And a pin. And up to three. And he missed. Did not kill anyone. So if you could put a down order dice on those guys, that'd be great. And my blown bazooka guy is right there. Okay. Uh, next die. The Americans. So do I have anything left over? Oh, I got this guy. 
Of course, his target is gone now, but I could fire on somebody else. My howitzer with the one crewman is going to fire on his armored car. So it's long range and one crewman, so I need a five. Ah. That would have been nice. I could have got some pins on, which would be helpful. Whose pins are these? Oh, these guys here? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Soviets. These guys uh, pass their order, move back to the grass, and they're going to shoot at these guys here. So long range moved. Even fives. Long range move. Needing fives. Here we go. Ooh, yeah. Nothing. Wow, man, we are both been whiffing on some rolls. Yeah, it's a weird game. It's been very strange. Another Soviet dice. The quad Maxim has finally made it in. Towards the end of the game here. And he's gonna fire and try to wipe out the rest of my poor Pathfinders. So it's 20 shots. Needing four is just removed. One more die. One more die. You can use one of mine, I suppose. No, they're all here. That's true. <laughs> so it's a lot of hits. That's all the hits, yeah. That's a lot of hits. Needing fives. It's my only hope. Come on, armor. Three die. And a pin. It's got to be morale test on there. Oh, uh, yeah, definitely. I, I need to die. But I am stubborn, so I'm rolling on full, my full uh, command of 10. One guy left. Uh, he makes it, so. Yeah, just one guy standing there with three pin, two, two pins. <laughs> that was interesting. 20 shots couldn't bring him down. Next day. Americans. Okay. I got all this stuff over here left to do something with. These guys, Poobart, again, second time in the same game with one pin. So there's no, no enemy within 12, so they just advanced as far as they could away from the enemy, which I guess they're the closest. Or They're actually out of line of sight. Maybe they should have came back this way. I guess, yeah, maybe they probably should have actually ran back because the en enemy they can see is those guys these guys actually went back this Five way or six, this game. six so and then you pulled one of your dice mm -hmm. okay so it's steve's turn and yeah these guys moved back foobard went down and he's going to do something the other truck of veterans advanced up this direction so he'll be able to get out americans again i should probably just rally my stupid paratroopers at this point Yeah, I think I'm pretty safe. So I'm going to just rally and see if I can get those pins off of those paratroopers. Yeah. Okay, they're pin free. Next day. Soviets. These guys advance out of the truck and they're kind of swinging around this way a little American bit. American die. Americans again. So what do I have left here? My mortar hasn't fired yet. Um, and I got all this. And that's pretty much it. Oh, my beep. My beep can do something. Let's do something with the beep. Two pins. Passes the order. Nice. Beep passed the order. Moved up. We're going to fire at that truck. So moved. And with a one pin, we're saying the wheat field does not give cover to a vehicle. Ooh, three, hits. three hits. One of these needs to be a six. No. So just a pin on the truck. Next die. So what do you got left? You got your officer in that truck over there. The sniper. The sniper. Green squad. And the uh, the green squad. Okay, and I have this squad and my two uh, my officer and my medic. My officer ran around the outside of the orchard. He's got to get some help over here because they got problems. Next die. So we squad, the old green squad, the now regular green squad, is uh, failed their order. And another Soviet died. Sniper's going to try to pass an order. Oh, yeah, forgot about him back there. No. Oh, he's veteran? He's veteran, he passes the one pin. Another sniper. That's two failed orders. And 
wonder how many is that for you for this game? Many, many. Like seven or eight at least, counting all those times you tried to come in off the edge. Next day. Uh, my medic. My medic came around just to rejoin the officer. I have one left. You should you have two left, actually. Two left. I would like... Oh, my mortar. My mortar's never fired. Uh, let's do a shot from the mortar onto... Uh, the. I guess the only thing I can see are those guys over in the grass over there. Needing a six. Oh, two inch, so probably can hit three of them. Uh -huh. And anything but two dead. Let's check this one. So two dead and D3 pins. One pin, two dead, and a morale test at only minus one. Not bad. So he's down to a squad leader and his one machine gun with no crewman. The squad leader's a crewman. And then uh, roll a morale test. I guess he could be, technically, it doesn't say. Eight. Yeah, you're good. Barely. Alright, and next die. Uh, next die is me. Steve's officer got out, ran up here, so he's actually in my table quarter now. And then I ran these guys around this way. And we begin turn five. It's gonna be blue. Uh, Coming down uh, to it. Oh boy. Hmm. So many choices. The Sherman is gonna activate first. He is going to fire his howitzer at them, so they're gonna go down, so they're gonna be out of the turn. I'm gonna leave them. These guys aren't gonna go down. So I'm gonna fire the, the bow machine gun over here and the Wait, cannon so there. It's just needing long range. So yeah, four fours range. there, and then I need a six to hit those guys, so. This could be a hell of a shot. No. And then uh, the bow machine gun is going to need fours. So two hits on them and nothing. So just a pin there and that's it. Next die. That was ineffective. That's why I don't expend big points on tanks in this game because the chances of them doing nothing are, are pretty high. Okay, these guys over here, I'm going to try to pass an order with them. They foobarred twice. If they foobar again, it could be terrible because you're right there. Eight. So they pass the order. Now we're going to move them out and get some line inside. We're going to fire on those guys. Steve has gone down. Yeah, so I have most everyone's in range. So I got ten dice. Needing five since you went down. Uh, one hit. Wow, man, I am. Just, it's either feast or fan. I'm either nailing them or I ain't doing shit. So one hit with those, and then I got three more shots needing sixes. I was gonna say I almost got two sixes there. So two hits. two total hits. Man. Uh, okay, I need some kills here. Eight kill would be good. Okay, got one. See if it's anyone important. It is. What do you got in there? You got an LMG, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, let's take the LMG out. And so he lost a man, took a pin. Okay. I'll take that, I suppose, the next die. So they went down, so they're not going to be coming around. So, man, now I'm getting all the dice. Yeah. All right, the beep tried to go, failed his order. So he's backed up over here. So the next one is mine again. My bazooka is gonna fi fire, he passed his order, he's gonna fire at the quad maxim. So I'm needing a six after all the modifiers. Ah, got it. Wait, you couldn't even hit the tray. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I reroll it then. Oh! <laughs> Dice God's loving honest nice. man. <laughs> <laughs> So anything but, nah, yeah, I'll no, probably man. whiff. No, it's a pen, so it's five, six, I think a bazooka's a five. Plus five. It's not a double dice pen, it's just a regular, so I need a four plus. Boom. Quad maxim destroyed. Ah, bazooka man. You're getting the uh, bronze star for that one. Next die. 
So we hey, I get to go. The armored car is moved this way. He's gonna fire down this fence line. So it's two LMGs, so it's eight shots. Right? Eight shots uh, moved, soft cover. Eight and fives. Take three hits. Three hits. And the regulars. Long grass. Oh no. Head and a pin. And a six. Nope. So a dead and a pin. So we'll just uh, pull a dead dude off. Throw a pin on and then next die. Me again? Damn. Now I'm getting them all. Alright, so 14 shots, right? I foobarred the freaking these guys here on their one pin. I fucking foobar the third time in the same game. <laughs> but this time, and then this time I do have an enemy within 12, so I he gets to shoot because I roll the two. So he's gonna try to wipe out my final uh pathfinder here. <laughs> So six, 14 shots, uh, you got... Some of them are long range, right? Some of them are long range, yeah. So it's all these guys back here. So you got, and the SMG, so you got two, four shots at normal range. But he is a small team. So you're uh, fours? Plus one right for that. Oh, plus one for the pin, yeah. It's fives. Two hits. So yeah. just, and then... Uh, Two hits for those, and then how many for the rest? Uh, there's four. I said uh, ten more. Cause I said fourteen. Oh man, that's three food. That's the most food bars I've ever had in one game. That's uh, even sixes, right? Yeah. So, so that's three, three more. more. So that's five hits. Three food bars in one game is got to be some kind of world record <laughs> <laughs> for me, at least. He's dead. Oh right. man. Actually, hey, that's the first my unit, first order. Yeah. First unit I've lost in this game. <laughs> You've lost four, I've lost one. I've lost five. Five. Oh, wow. And it's one one point per uh, kill point, too. So right now, you're actually winning. Uh, you got six points over here in my un my uh, area, because you have two units fully in my area. And I don't have any fully in yours, but I do have five kill points. So another American dice. My truck has advanced up. We're gonna fire on those guys along the fence there. Eight and fives. Okay, a hit, so that's another pin. Let's see if we can get anyone. No. And next die. Soviets. Our pass in order, he's gonna fire at these guys. I guess I should have probably went down. Oh well. So that's four hits. Four hits. Another pin. So I'm at four pins now. Damn. I'm going to have to rally them. Oh, Three damn. Nine. Holy crap. <laughs> Three and two guys. So, so I got two take BARs. The, take the two BARs and the guy that's closest to them. <laughs> well, that's my sergeant. We'll take him too, then. Well, you only get to pick two. <laughs> so do you want to kill the two BARs? That's still not 50%, though. Or is it 25? I think it's 50 I don't know. So we're up to four. All right. Man, I understand this game. It's like we can roll no nothing, and then we <laughs> can't miss. It's an Easter fan. <laughs> Next die. Yeah, well, I was kind of waiting to rally those guys. All right. Yeah, Didn't expect to lose half of them, or almost half of them. So I'm going to... So you still got your green squad. You still got them. You yeah. still got them. You got a lot of stuff left. Your officer. Oh, uh, you pulled all the early dice. They're not green anymore. No. They're regular. But they still failed on a 10. So they had they failed their order. Man, another failed order. I mean, to see how many orders we failed in this game. <laughs> it's a oh, lot. I guess I have to pull it out. Counting all the uh, foo bars and all the times you couldn't get your guys in off the board or up from reserves. Uh, um, let's see here. Uh, what do I have left? I got my paratroopers, my mortar, my officer, my medic, and I think that's it. Oh, and these guys. So I think you're done over here, right? No. You don't I have any. More to do. What do you have left over here? Got my sniper. We got the LMG squad. Got these guys. That's right. So I'm gonna fire my mortar over here. It's a hit. Anything but. They're dead. So that squad is wiped out. 
hanging on by a thread over there next die okay I kind of want to need to finish firing these guys so I can do my rally but there might not be anyone left of that squad by then okay this uh, machine gun squad here what do we want to do there my um, paratrooper squad ran around. We've got to try to get over to the so table the quarter. Oh, there it is. And my officer will... What the hell is he going to do? My officer sprinted over to there. Soviets. Sniper passes order. He's advancing. He's going to shoot two rifles at the bazooka. Oh, uh, just a sniper. No, but he can fire as, with rifles. As rifles. If you want. Oh, they both can shoot them? Yeah. So be moved, small team, soft cover. Okay. Bazooka don't care. We got one turn left for the bazooka to really cement his legacy by killing that armored car. My medic. Uh, my medic will run over and join these guys. Okay. That should be it for me. You got your officer, you got your truck over there, you got that squad with two pins. I'm going to try to pass an order with this squad. They're going to foobar. No, they didn't foobar. They failed. Though. They did fail though, yeah. Yeah, because there are nine with two pins. Another failed order. That was a lot. A lot for you, but even more when we combine both of ours. Another Soviet order dice. I think the last two, I think you have the last of them, so. No, there's two, there's two, there's there two. What? So two more? The truck is going to shoot on your howitzer or your mortar. Okay. So move, side uh, Small team. It's three a small team? I two no, I, I lost a guy oh, in the, bar the preliminary know. barrage, remember? <laughs> Way back at the beginning of the game. Sixes. Oh, golly. We can roll, too. Oh. Yeah, the small team paid off that time. Yeah, you should knock out one of your guys on every... Uh... So I choose to bring two guys. All right, this guy here, they're going to rally. Let's see if I can get all four of those pins off. <laughs> <laughs> Fourth foobar of the game. That's got to be a freaking record. And another enemy shooting. Oh, that's better than withdrawing. Oh yeah, I'd rather shoot my own guys than withdraw. <laughs> I guess you've got nothing to shoot, right? So I got four... No, you pick. Oh, I pick. Yeah, that's the second time in the same game. Yeah, because I rolled a two, which means you get to pick... Um, I'm within 12 of you, so I'm assuming. Yeah, there you go. So, uh, yeah, you get to pick who I shoot at. Luckily, you killed oh, all my BARs off. <laughs> The bazooka. Well, you shoot the bazooka at minus four? That's not... It'd be minus four... Five. Like it'd be sevens. A, it'd be sevens, yeah. So it'd be two, Actually, five shots. Actually, it's going to be sevens no matter what, right? Yeah. So that's not... So, but you can get lucky. So it's... Can I? <laughs> um, yeah, shoot the bazooka. What the hell? Okay, so it's five shots. SMG and three rifles. Unbelievable. Oh, God. Don't kill my bazooka. My own guy. No! <laughs> this is some shit. <laughs> he doesn't oh, die, though. He takes a pin. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is the weirdest. Oh, this game is just something else, man. <laughs> okay, that's everybody. Oh, no, I'm sorry. You, you got another guy, and then I, I got do, I do not have another guy. What do I have? Well, they, I'm sorry, they rallied. Yeah, they, they failed yeah. their rally order. <laughs> they so I, guess, I got the last one, which is... What do you have left? Uh, Soviets have been, they've taken quite a beating. They've lost six order dice. I've only lost one, and that was to my own guys. I almost lost my second one to my own guys. So last turn here. It's been a wild game. Ah, oh, yes, the Americans. So the first dice, this squad's going to advance, and we're going to fire on them. We got to point blank, he went down. But still hitting on fours because no movement penalty and point blank. One, two, three, four, five, six hits. Point 
thing. I don't have to pass any orders anywhere. <laughs> Need fives. One, two, three, four dead. Wow, that's pretty good roll. And then I got one, six. So four dead. Is that over half? Yep. Yep, and you're up to two pins. You have your officer there, though? Is he still back there? Yeah, there he is. Your officer? Isn't he back here? Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, okay. So he'll give you a plus one. So take a test. Pretty much anything but uh, double six will do you. Yeah, you're good. But yeah, we did do some damage, but that's not enough. That's not enough. Next die. Another one of mine. You could pass the order, or within 12 that armored car. Actually, your light cover. So oh, you're force. Out of cover, so. Yeah, but I'm shooting through right. most of it. If I was over here, I would say yeah, but since I'm kind of situated. You got a pin on you. Now. No, not anymore. Thank God. Damn! It would have been hit if I wasn't shooting through cover. Next die. Another one of mine. Well, I guess the Sherman will have to do some damage. Two bar squad passed their order this time and they ran in straight over there. And another. Did you pull one of yours? No. Oh, you're just measuring. Another one of mine. Okay. Um, the hell can I do here? How about uh, this guy? I'll fire. So can I just shoot over them? Since <laughs> no, why not? Because <laughs> you can't. My machine gun's up higher, though. That's the rules. Is it? I thought you could. You can't could do that. shoot. You can't shoot within an inch if the weapon could damage, injure them. An inch vertically? <laughs> or horizontally. Well, you just have a bigger scale truck than I do. Then. I do. Yeah, it's a 148 truck. <laughs> they come in handy sometimes. My truck is going to just sit and fire at that squad there. I need the fives. Or fours for long range. Uh, two hits. Another pin. Go ahead and get some kills. Got one. Let's see if it's anyone good. Nope. So a kill and another pin. Next die. Next die. I'm just thinking. Oh. Well, I guess it doesn't matter because I'm not pulling any of my dice anyway. There you go. You don't have any dice. Or hardly. So I was able to run my airborne squad up. Steve's going to concede. Uh, he can't win at this point. So we'll come back and wrap it up. In the end, these Americans have won the skirmish with the Soviets at the Elbe River. Uh, they're going to go back to their HQs and ask, what the hell was that? And then pretend like nothing ever happened. <laughs> So in the end, I had uh, two full two units fully in his. That's six points. Uh, this guy I don't think is. Plus I got a bunch six of kill six points. kill points. So that's twelve. Uh, I had another one in one of the neutral. I had another known for the tank in the neutral. And then you had six for having your two your uh, HQ and your squad. The empty transport chain doesn't count. So yeah, it was uh, pretty. Uh, one-sided in the end when you look at the points so tough it was a very strange game I mean just the amount of failed orders the amount of foo bars was <laughs> way higher than than we're used to seeing I mean you well how many did you fail to come in well I failed well, at least uh, my reserves failed a hundred percent on the first try uh -huh. and I think I got one in on the second try so that was the third turn yeah, so you had six so chances. It was, it was the fourth turn, I think, before they came in. Yeah, you had six chances in the first, on turn two and three, and one, so you're one for six, and then it was even, then you even failed another one with the quad yeah. maxim after by, that. By turn four, I had only had four units that activated, that passed their orders right. and were able to activate. Yeah, and then I was foobarring. So these guys foobarred twice. He, they foobarred and actually killed my Pathfinder. And then these guys foobarred and almost took out my bazooka. Fortunately, they had so many pins, they couldn't hit anything. Yeah, that was the only good thing. <laughs> um, yeah, it was a 
interesting game. Uh, I think that it's a little. I mean, I guess I get it. You wait till the end and then run everyone into the enemy table quarter. That's what we did. So that's what the rules say. It doesn't say they're contested. It just says if you're in there, regardless if there's enemy all around you, you're in there. So definitely, it's trying to create a game with a lot of movement, which it does. And it's spread out across the whole board, which we like to see. It's not all happening in one small area. So it's it's always nice when the game is there's movement and there's and it's spread out to use the whole board. So anyway, yeah, it's a crazy wild game. Um, I've never seen so many failed orders in one game that I can remember. I'm sure I would remember because it it's kind of a memorable thing. So. Yeah, the armored car failed twice in a row. Armored car, that's backing right. Backing off the table. Yeah, you're lucky he couldn't go off. Yeah, he failed. That, that preliminary barrage really did a number on Steve's guys. Because he failed with his mortar, his sni didn't sniper. Sniper, mortar. But you were trying to pass orders, too. He should have probably just rallied. Well, that would only be a one pip advantage. Yeah, but you were going to fail anyway. It's not like that. <laughs> yeah, they would have failed either way, so... Yeah, some of those were 10s, 11s. Um, they would have failed their rally. So we'll go ahead and wrap it up for tonight. So another game of bolt action in the bag. Um, still like to play this game. It's fun. And uh, as usual, check out our Facebook group and our Patreon page. And um, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.